YouTube channel. Today, I thank all the people who have subscribed to my channel and to those who gave feedback to my videos. My videos were created based on what I learned when I play and also from the other Roblox experts who shared their experiences as well. In that note, you can see different YouTubers sharing almost the same idea. So continue watching my video guys. Let's get started. Today, I'm gonna show you how to make your own spinning spinning part in our black studio so before we begin make sure to like and subscribe and turn notifications to all to see more videos so let's get started so first you need to insert your own part and then scale it make sure the make sure the shape is square and size won't matter just make sure the shape is square just like that and also make sure your part is anchor now you need to move it and then you need to go on model tab now you need to press surface beside the color now press studs you can also you can also turn you can also make your part into other surface I just want to change it to studs so select your studs again to stop using it now you need you need to go on Explorer you need to name your part into platform base and then we need to duplicate and then now you need to name your plat your selected platform base into turn platform and just like that now you need to move this make sure it's the it's at the top of the platform base and also make sure it's it's not anchor so it will be able to sw spin and also size it whatever you want and i want to size it to this and now let's make this little bit higher so we can add a hinge let's add some hinge so to add a hinge you need to press model and then you need to press this button right here the create you need to find the create now you will press this button beside the create it's the arrow now you will press hinge now you need to press your platform platform base and then you will connect it to your your own turn platform but make sure it's straight so it will be able to spin properly now you need to go on view press properties and go and you need to go on your explorer now you need to press this button right here be beside the platform base then you will press hinge constraint now you need to go on actu at actuator type the actuator type is motor and then yeah like that now you need to change the angular velocity into one the, now the motor max just put a bunch of nines there let's enter and now let's exit let's co close tab the the properties if you are done using it now let's go play let's play this game let's see if this works And it worked it worked guys it worked so guys that's it for the video make sure to like and subscribe and turn notifications to all to see more videos and see you